Hey there, Samuel Larson here. Now, I want to start off with something that I wholeheartedly believe. And that's that too many e-commerce stores are just way too general in how they're presented. They are bland, they are boring, and most of all, they lack any kind of memorable character. Now, there's over 1 million Shopify stores out there. But think like, um, how many do you really need? How many would you miss if uh, all of them were be gone? And how many do you really care about? So how many of these could you not live without? And how many you actually love so much that uh, your life would be worse if they didn't exist? And this is the key message in this channel. You want your e-commerce store to be better than others. And uh, with e-commerce stores especially, too many focus on just bringing more and more traffic. They are not focusing on converting the traffic as efficiently as they could, and they are not focused on making the most out of their store. They just keep uh, doing whatever got their initial results. In these cases, it's often traffic. Traffic got you your first sales. Traffic got you to $1,000 a month, $2,000 a month, but it will not get you to that massive scale. You have to try different things. So. In this channel, we are just looking for ways to escape that. And that's so what this channel is about. So with that said, let's cover us uh, how we can use about us pages to powerfully build a little bit of a moat around the business to make it unique and impact those customers to convert into buyers and to tell them a story that is unique, that is memorable, and that shows how special your store really is. Now. I speak with a lot of e-commerce merchants and I know you might be thinking here, I sent my traffic to product page. Why does my about us page matter? Well, it does matter because it is the one page that is purely about you and the competition where you have similar products, you are going to need to stand out some way. And oftentimes we find that people might ping off uh, different product pages, then they go to about us page to check if they can really trust the store and to get them to know a little bit more about that. And that is your chance because many of the product pages, a lot of the pricing is so similar that how do you stand out? How do you stand out in a way that doesn't cost you more every time that you make a sale? Because you could make your prices cheap. You could offer or free shipping, but that's going to cost you money. If you just make your about us page good once, it's going to be there like a machine working for you. And it is really a fantastic opportunity. You have people putting up their hand here saying that I want to learn about you. Would you please tell me about you? And too many stores just say like, no, we don't care about <laughs> telling us about you, <laughs> about us. Uh, it's like, um, we have nothing to tell you. That's the message. And people are asking that and you are not engaging them. It's a huge problem. And how are you going to stand out with this uh, general stuff? So let's look into this and let's solve this for you. So how do we solve this problem? There's a great quote here, and uh, it comes down to understanding what the visitor actually wants at that point. And they are there for a reason. And the quote goes, for you to achieve your goal, the customer must first achieve theirs. Now, what are people looking for when they come to the About Us page? Well, most likely they want to know a bit more about you. And uh, the easiest way to solve this is the story-like format. And you can make up a little bit of a story around your store it doesn't need to be 100 percent real likely it's better if it's not a complete lie but uh, you can definitely use a little bit of pencil to make it more engaging nobody's going to find out this way you have your story instantly that makes you unique nobody has that exact same story especially if you use a brain a little bit then at the same time with the story like format maybe a couple of pictures behind the scenes showing the warehouse, showing the founder, um, having a, a little bit of a signature of the founder, that kind of thing, you can build a lot of trust. And with story, you can also build a lot of authority. So ideally your store hits, or your story on your About Us page, hits this uniqueness, trust, authority. And if it does, your About Us page will not be a hindrance to your sales. It will be an accelerator. And this is a fantastic opportunity because now you have people that are open to being influenced. And with your story, 
you can build a strong emotional impact. And there's so many studies that people need to feel emotion before they can make decisions. So before your customer can buy, they need to feel emotion. If you have some kind of brain damage where you cannot feel emotions, you cannot make decisions at all. Like they have had people like this that they've studied. If you don't feel any emotions, you cannot make decisions. So emotions come before decisions. And about us page is a powerful way to communicate emotions. Then decisions are the ones that lead to revenue and profits. It's multiple micro decisions made by multiple people that uh, form this big, powerful stream of income, hopefully, uh, that uh, will fool your store, will fool your marketing and will fool your business. So think of it as emotions first. Think of it in a story like format, carefully map it out and think of what you want to convey. So that's it. With a strong emotional impact, you will be able to be memorable with memorability. You will be able to incentivize more recurring purchases. And there's data from Shopify that says that a 5% increase in retention correlates to at least 25% increase in profit. So guys, if you want to increase your profit by 25%, increase your revenue retention by 5% and you're likely going to be there or more. So take every advantage that you can to powerfully communicate your brand. Think of Apple, for example. People buy those phones over and over again. They powerfully identify with the brand and they don't even consider other options once they're in those ecosystems. So that's uh, the way that you want your business to be, where you have these powerful reasons for them not to go anywhere else. And the very last thing I'm going to leave you with is the impact on branding. So business is basically competition. You have alternative products, you have competing products. The money is going to go somewhere. You want your store and your brand to be so good that it differentiates you from average, where you will be able to escape competition, but even more importantly, escape price competition. So you don't want to be on the same line as uh, cheap Chinese products, for example. So it is a position of luxury. It's a position of differentiation and value in marketing, in business, in consumerism, it's always perceived. Stop thinking of it as logically as like facts of uh, this land, for example, like certain lumines or whatever. It doesn't matter. It is that emotional impact that uh, makes the purchase. And with today's e-commerce, you want to escape competition. It's all about taking every opportunity to escape competition. Now, that's the theory behind about us pages. We have created a practical video about this as well. And that's uh, what we are going to link on the end screen. Before that, though, make sure to subscribe to this channel. I have only e-commerce content. Make it as good as I can. And uh, I can see that you like what I have. So subscribe now. If you have questions, answers will be in the comments. Just ask away. And like the video to hint to YouTube that they should uh, show this more on your homepage. All right. Thanks for watching. Take care. Make a lot of money in e-commerce. And I'll see you on the next one.